Good morning, Farmington. Today is Thursday, March 4th. My name is Josh Brown, bringing you your morning news. Today for lunch, we will be having pepperoni pizza wedge, cheese pizza stuffed crust, steamed broccoli, hamburger basket, romaine salad, fruit, milk, and chocolate chip cookie. Seniors, the Farmington Police Department is ready to award two lucky recipients with scholarships. The applications can be picked up in the counselor's office. They will need to be returned to the counselor's office no later than Wednesday, March 31st, 2021. All details for the awards will be listed on the scholarship application. If you are unable to attend the cheer dance tryout meeting, cheer will have open gyms this Monday and Tuesday, 3.30 to 4.30, and dance will have open gyms on Wednesday and Thursday, 3.30 to 4.30 at the cheer dance studio. All paperwork must be turned in at those times this week only. Fellowship of Christian Athletes will meet every Friday morning at 7.30 in Ms. Selby's room, D211. Teachers, if you have any other announcements that you would like added, please contact or email Mr. Dean or fill out the Google form that was sent out via email. Well, that's going to do it today for us in the news. And next in the Card Center, we have Ashley with the latest and grace in sports. Have a thoughtful Thursday, Card Center. Remember, wear your masks. Thanks, Josh. My name is Ashley in the Card Center with the latest and grace in sports. Soccer season started this past Monday when the Farmington boys team faced off against the Prairie Grove Tigers. This was the first ever home soccer match for Farmington and the boys team came away with a 3-2 victory over the Tigers. Sophomore Jorge Cervantes scored the first Farmington goal at Cardinal Stadium and was followed up by two penalty kick goals by Luis Zavala. Both the girls and boys soccer teams were in action on Tuesday night when they traveled to Lincoln to take on the Lincoln Wolves. The Lady Cardinals came out victorious by a final score of 5-0 and the boys team extended their undefeated season to 2-0 by defeating the Wolves 5-2. Both the boys and girls teams will face Grove Oklahoma Ridge Runners on Friday here at Cardinal Stadium. The JV girls will start the action off that night at 4 o'clock and will be followed by the varsity girls and then the varsity boys. It's regional tournament week in basketball. The Lady Cardinals will be the two seed heading into the regional tournament this week in Ozark. The Lady Redbirds will play the Pottsville Apache today at 4. The game will be live streamed on live.farmcards.org or at Farm Cards Live YouTube page. Also, the boys Cardinal basketball team punched their ticket to the state tournament last night with a 50-59 victory over the Subiaco Academy Trojans. Coach Taylor's group will continue their quest to a possible regional tournament tomorrow at 1 o'clock in Ozark. Remember, if you can't make it to the game, you can catch all the action on live.farmcards.org or by going to YouTube and searching Farm Cards Live. The 2021 Cardinal baseball season continued today when they faced off the Salem Spring Panthers in a regular season non-conference game before continuing in the PBR Classic on Saturday. The Lady Cardinals will continue their 2021 season today when they travel to Rogers to take on the Lady Mounties at 5. And on Friday, the Lady Redbirds will travel to Fayetteville at 5 to take on the Lady Purple Dogs. Well, that is going to do it for us in the Card Center today. Have a thoughtful Thursday, Farmington, and remember, wear your masks.